Welcome to Electra Online. The next topic we're going to cover with circles is the angle measures within circles. Whenever we can find a chord, which is the diameter, with other words, a chord that goes right through the center of the circle, that means that the circle is divided in two equal halves, which means that each half will subtend an angle of 180 degrees, which means that this angle right here will be 180 degrees, and this angle right here will also be 180 degrees. So in this example, we have three angles in the top half of the circle, one that's marked 25x degrees, the other one that's marked 3x degrees, the other one that's marked 2x degrees, and they want us to find the value for x. So in this case, since all three angles make up the top half of the circle, we can say that 25x degrees plus 3x degrees plus 2x degrees equals to 180 degrees. When we add these together, we get 30 x degrees equals 180 degrees, or x degrees equals 180 degrees divided by 30. So x degrees equals 6 degrees, or x equals 6. So that's how we find the value for x. On the left side, it may not be quite as obvious, but again, you can see there's a line right here that goes right across from one end of the circle to the other side of the circle, it goes right to the center of the circle. That means that this is here, the diameter. So the left side makes an angle of 180 degrees and the right side does. So on the left side, we can say that x minus one degrees plus three x plus five degrees equals 180 degrees. On the right side, we can say that 60 degrees plus the angle from A to B to C, make it a little shorter here, ABC also add up to 180 degrees. So in this case, we're trying to find the value for the angle ABC, and so therefore, we first have to figure out, whoa, that makes it easy. Yes, that makes it easy because that's the right half, so we can simply say the angle ABC is equal to 180 degrees minus 60 degrees, which is equal to 120 degrees and we're done. However, what if they also want to find the value for x? Well, then we have to solve this side, this equation right here for the left side of the circle. And so the first thing we're going to do is uh, separate these out. So we have x degrees minus 1 degree plus 3x degrees plus 5 degrees equals 180 degrees. And then uh, we can combine these, 1x plus 3x, which is 4x degrees, and that plus 5 degrees is equal to 180 degrees. Now we can move, oh, not 5, 4, because it's 5 minus 1, 4 degrees. Now move that across, so we have 4x degrees is equal to 176 degrees, subtracting 4 from both sides. And then we can say that x degrees is equal to, 4 goes in 16, uh, 74 times, left that, that's 44. Yes, 44 degrees, or x equals 44. So we can also solve for x, and we also solve for the angle ABC. And that is how it's done.